Hey guys, today we're gonna be talking about Lao Summer uh, in summary, which is gonna quickly go over what's coming to the Korean server. Hopefully this is coming for us as well in the future. So let's quickly start it up. Uh, I'm just gonna going through, you know, like with short talking about what's happening and what's coming. So let's begin. So first and foremost, um, we're getting, you know, you can hide your status if you're online, offline, and plus we're getting that you can visit um, your friends, strongholds, even if they're on another server. So this is nothing major, it's just quality of life stuff. Then the next we're getting the tripod update. This is quite big, to be honest, I'm going to talk about it a little bit. So tripod system is going to be reworked uh, once you obtain the tripod. I mean, success transfer it. <clears throat> you can equip whenever you want just by paying silver. So it's really good stuff, uh, to be honest. Uh, it's going to save us a lot, a lot of, of failed transfers, you know, all over again, you know. So it's a big change. Let's go on. So next, we're going to get Hell Mode Guardian. Um, the first Guardian was Kyle Egos, I think. Uh, so it's it, it's gonna be difficult, to be honest. Um, they said, uh, I think if I'm not forgetting, they said it's gonna be on par with some strong content we have in the game already. So we're gonna see how how it's gonna be look. You know, probably it's gonna be hard. Hopefully. So the next is going to be about class balance. So they said they want to reduce, you know, the class balance path cycles uh, to make it like small changes, but more often. Mm, so to focus on some classes that really needs more like reworks and stuff like that. But they want to improve, you know, you know, uh, so we get faster updates, like faster changes to the classes so that we don't have to wait for a long time before, you know, uh, we get some small fixes, like small buffs or, you know, nerfs. And let's go on on the next one. So uh, this is a huge improvement to Book of Coordination. So you can test your classes, you know, in Trixion, you know, like builds and everything like that. As you can see, we have much more options now with card sets, with everything, like tripods, you know, uh, gems as well. This is going to be, make it much more, you know, uh, viable to, when you're building your class to test it out however you want to approach. So it's a good change. I, I really like this one. Let's move on to the next one. So MVP screen, uh, changing the MVP screens. So we're gonna get like emblems, you know, with MVP screen. Uh, like whenever you do something, uh, maybe you're the last one to survive or so on, you know, you're gonna get badges. And if I'm not mistaken, they're gonna probably level up, you know, with the more times you successfully do like some some sort of achievement. So. Um, it's it's all right, you know, just a, an overall UI improvement, you know, nothing that specific. Uh, next is the PvP improvements. It's more not like PvP improvements. I know that you're going to add up the bots. It's going to be much easier, you know, as well, like, like the Book of Coordination is going to be much easier to, you know, gear up, you know, for PvP. So it's a decent change as well, you know, I, I honestly like it. This is just, you know, uh, selfie, selfie mode improvements, you know, like poses, stickers and everything like that. It's a nice change now, I guess, for whoever uses that. Uh, so just a quick quality of life, world map convenience, just zoom out and zoom in, you know, uh, nothing major. 
So we're getting a uh, skin storage. So it's rooster wide, if I'm not mistaken what they said. Uh, it's rooster wide um, for a certain skins, you know, like Evan skins and so on. So it's a really nice thing for whatever has a lot of skins to save your space. And hopefully it's gonna come for us soon. Uh, this is this is how update like um, like a boost like welcome challenges for new users like uh, there's some there's gonna be some kind of boost like you know for like the first or maybe two gates you know they, they haven't yet decided on that but they were talking about that there's some there's gonna, gonna be some kind of boost for new play clear like like a trials you know for the legion raids. Well, and then we got Elgasia after story. This is the addition to, you know, the story after Elgasia. So it's far, far away for our version. And of course, the new class, Aromancer DPS. Well, Synergy DPS as they called. Uh, Umbrella is the main weapon. Um, from honest, what I saw in trailer, it looked like uh mage with dead blade mix in my opinion to be honest in my opinion uh stronghold improvements uh there's gonna be quite a lot of stronghold improvements you know there, i think there's already a trailer in korean so you can decorate indoors buildings and stuff like that you know so just general stronghold improvements as i said you can visit other players stronghold you know in different servers as well uh, a new guardian after the gorilla chan so this is basically fire version of levanos like as i would say fire version of the big three i mean this is far for for our version so yeah uh, this is the hell mode i was talking about uh rapport for elgasia npcs and big daddy akan raid it's gonna come out on august for koreans uh, a new island oh uh, we're getting a new island uh so new island is gonna be with story and the boss mode plus the soul from the boss so it's like a some kind of like a mini game in this island And least but not last, we're gonna get new collectibles. So it's like a music box of memory. So there is total of them in the beginning and they're gonna add up as over time now. So I assume we're gonna collect some stories, music or whatever. I'm not yet sure about this one. And this is summer went for Koreans, you know. In, well, their summer went with new skins for them. Uh, this is uh, a boost, uh, they're, uh, you know, like um, Express, you know, they're gonna get to 1460 now, an upgrade. Uh, a new Arc Pass for them is on the way as well. Uh, just collaborations, Mokokovit Ocean World. Uh, this is events only for Korean server. And now let's go into Akan preview. Now is Aeromancer and that's gonna be it guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, see you guys next time, peace.
수고하셨어요.